Hi everyone, welcome to my kitchen. In today's recipe, I'm going to show you how to make a honey chili sesame potato. It's essentially a chili potato that is made in a healthy way. I'm going to be boiling the potatoes, roasting it in the uh, pan until it becomes nice and crisp and then tossing it along with some, um, you know, Asian uh, uh, condiments as you can say. So without wasting any time, let me just dive right in and show you how to make a honey chili sesame potato, also a chili potato. So let's just dive right in. So the first thing I'm going to do is into a mixing bowl, combine all the sauces so they are ready to be tossed into the potatoes. Into a mixing bowl, I'm just going to go ahead and add in the honey. We'll add in the vinegar, the sweet and spicy red chili sauce, the tomato ketchup and the soy sauce. Great, so now we're going to whisk this all up until they become nice and smooth and we'll keep this to the side. So now to roast the potatoes and put them all together into a pan, add in the oil. So once the oil is heated, we'll go ahead and add in our sesame seeds and roast it in the oil for a few seconds. And the sesame seeds really cook very quickly, so don't allow it to brown too much. Just roast for a few seconds because it's going to get roasted along with the potatoes as well. I'm going to go ahead and add in the garlic and ginger, lots of it because that adds a lot of taste and chilies, you can add more or less as per how chilly you want your chili potatoes to be and just give it a stir and then finally the spring onion bulb as well as the greens that I've chopped up and kept so we'll just saute this for a few seconds. And once you can start smelling the aromas coming through, I'm going to go ahead and add in our boiled potatoes into this. So I'm just going to go ahead and add just a little bit of salt. Remember all our sauces have a lot of uh, salt content in them. So we'll just add just a little bit of salt and we'll roast the potatoes for about four to five minutes. Okay, And then after that, we'll toss in the sauces. So notice that after four to five minutes of roasting on high heat, the potatoes have lightly roasted and I've got some nice brown spots and this is just perfect. We just need them to roast a bit until you see golden brown spots around the potatoes. This is perfect and now I'm ready to add in our uh, spicy chili uh, honey sauce that we made just a while ago and we'll toss it up on high heat until the potatoes get well. Uh, you know, coated with all the sauces, okay? And in about four to five minutes, once you notice the potatoes are well coated and the sauce is thickened up, you can turn off the heat. So notice how beautifully the potatoes have got uh, well coated with all the Asian sauces that we made. Great, so now I'm ready to serve the potatoes and the last thing I'm gonna do is to add in the spring onion greens to give it that color. And, uh, and a light touch of flavor as well. So I really hope you enjoyed watching the recipe of how to make the honey chili sesame potato, also known as the chili potato, as it's popularly called. Um, well, it's simple, isn't it? All you need to ensure is that you have all the ingredients ready and handy, prepped and kept, and after that, just have to toss it all up to make this delicious tasting honey chili sesame potato. Um, you can serve this potato as an appetizer for parties by putting in some toothpicks and your friends and family would absolutely love it. Or you can also toss, have it along with some Hakka noodles, um, Chinese fried rice and uh, you know any other Indo-Chinese dish that you like to make at home. So do give this recipe a try and when you do, don't forget to take a snapshot of it and uh, tag us across all your social channels and love to hear from you. So until then, until next time, happy cooking and healthy eating.